Hello, welcome to Success Evening School. This is a civic education for Junior Technical 3 and Junior Secondary 3. Parents, we would advise you to monitor your warts to be with their writing materials and they should pay attention. Are we ready? I guess we are, let's go. Today's topic is the right attitude to work, under this topic we would consider the following. Meaning of the right attitude to work, attributes, the words and consequences of not having the right attitude to work. The right attitude to work is the positive state of mind and behavior a businessman, worker or employee, has by following diligently the code of practice towards the success of his business organization or the government. I would take that against students. I said that the right attitude to work is the positive state of mind and behavior a businessman, worker or employee, has by following diligently the code of practice towards the success of his business organization or the government. A worker who has the right attitude to work is one who cherishes and loves his work, he goes to work or school on time, always thinks of making his work effective, he or she attains to customers promptly and with respect, he or she treats everyone in his office with respect and fairness. Similarly, a student with the right attitude to learning goes to school early, he or she does his or her morning functions, attains classes, does his or her assignments, and does corrections to assignments perfectly, he or she obeys school rules and regulations. I hope you are still listening to me and taking down notes as well. Now we would be looking at the attributes of a person with the right attitude to work. Honesty. Honesty is the quality of being truthful, sincere and straightforward in one's dealings with others. Punctuality. This is the quality of being on time to work, school or any place of assignment. Regularity. This is simply reporting to your duty post at the right time every day. Discipline. An individual obeys rules, regulations or code of practice of his or her place of work or school. Civility. This is when an individual chooses politeness to everyone while performing his or her duties. Now we would be looking at the rewards of having the right attitude to work. I'll need you to pay attention. After this lesson, assignments would be given. Number 1. It creates a positive environment. Number 2. It helps to achieve goals and career success. Number 3. It reduces stress and helps you in all your managements. Number 4. It promotes a better health and gives an individual less sick days. Number 5. It increases productivity levels and produces more energy. Next up is the Consequences of having the right attitude to work. Support of others. Building relationships with those you work with will be made far easier if you have a positive attitude. Your positivity will inspire those around you to get involved and support you in your work. A positive working attitude will help the team build to grow and give you co-workers you can count on. Promotion. The majority of us want to climb the ladder in our careers gaining more responsibility and a healthier pay packet at the end of each month. By demonstrating a positive working attitude your employer will see you as a leader, role model and team builder giving you the edge over other colleagues when it comes to that promotion. By being positive you are far more likely to achieve your goals and appear professional to your employer. Results, a negative attitude in the workplace has never been noted for getting results. With a target to achieve your task to complete, a positive working attitude is the only way to get there. Being positive will improve your productivity and eagerness to work, giving you faster and better results every time. Higher earnings, as well as making you stand out from the crowd when it comes to promotions, a positive attitude will help you to close deals. Pay rises and bonuses are rarely given to those who cannot close a deal. By being positive your customers are far more likely to buy from you allowing you to repeatedly close deal after deal increasing your earning potential. Strength. By presenting a positive attitude, you will become incredibly resilient. Any stresses or bumps in the road will be easily solved with a strong and positive attitude. Being strong comes with positivity and will earn your respect from your colleagues. I hope we learned a lot today. Now it's time for assignments. Please take this down. Number 1. What is the right attitude to work? Number 2. State three benefits of having the right attitude to work. I'll take that again, state three benefits of having the right attitude to work. And finally, name two consequences of having the right attitude to work. We have come to the end of today's class, I hope we learned a lot. Parents we would advise you to assist your awards and make sure they do their assignments.